give 99%, you'll make my job very, very easy. I'll be your coach. I won't be your friend. If you need one of those, take it up with Doc or Coach Patrick. All right, gentlemen. Congratulations to all of you. That's it for today. On the way out, pick up one of these. Got a little homework to do before you celebrate. <laughs> Thank you. Walter, how are we doing? I think we got a problem here, Herb. What's that? I got a room full of people up there who want to have a say in this process, and you've already picked the team. Look, Walter. No, no. Now, there's a right way to do this kind of thing, and this is not it. And I know you got a job to do, and if I was in your shoes, I'd probably be saying the same thing. All right. Let's go upstairs. We'll help piece together a hockey team. All of us, together. Walter. That's just not gonna happen. Do you realize what the AHA went through to put this thing together? The best amateur players in the country on the ice for a week, yeah. not just a day. And I didn't ask for that because I already know my team. How do you know your team? Those kids haven't been on the ice for what, maybe a couple of hours. Walter, every one of those boys was chosen for a specific reason. I've studied film on each and every one of those boys. I've seen them, I've watched them, and I've coached a lot of them. And the ones I haven't, I've spoken with our coaches and scouts in the area. Now, I know best what I need to compete, and the team I've chosen is it. What am I supposed to say to the advisory board, the committee? Tell them the truth. This puts me in a hell of a spot, Herb. Hell of a spot. Well, they hired me.